brain. Well, you almost knocked me out. If you don't shut up, I'm gonna beat you. It's abusive. Ugh, you drive me insane. <laughs> Hey guys, what's going on? This Flawless Crest of Geckos here, Will, Audra. Hi. And we are coming to you guys with another one from the Diamond Series. Mm -hmm. And today we have a very, very special gecko we're talking about because it is absolutely beautiful. <laughs> As if they all weren't beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> Well, we would definitely like to believe they are. They we are. are going to continue working with them, nevertheless. They are. But um, uh, this week, actually, we're, we're hitting Taliban's offspring. Taliban actually came to us from our brother, Brian, Brian. from Altitude Exotics. Um, his uh, high white, extreme high white project. Uh, we were able to add Taliban. Has she been here three years? Maybe? Yeah. Three, three years, years ago. Um, we added her and thankful, uh, oh man, so thankful to be able to have her. Her pattern and coverage and color, she has some yellow tones to her as well. But uh, It's insane because her offspring is more high right. white. And she stems from his uh, blow, blow. blow line. Yeah, blow. Um, so anybody that knows his blow line knows like... It's actually legit, Tell you know. Me. So we got um, Taliban from him, um, him, and then she was paired to Yoshi. Yoshi, so, <laughs> our stud on a breeder, yes. high white male. It's funny because um, either if if it's high white right now, like from what we're breeding currently mm -hmm. and what our grow out is right now, it's usually either Yoshi or Ric Flair. A lot of our holdbacks are yep. Yoshi, Ric, Ric Flair. Flair. Uh, panty dropper, panty dropper too. but panty droppers are red based while high white right. so but if it's like just high white or white spot trade it's gonna be yoshi or rick flair right and then you've got glacier who had a lot glacier, of in him um, too yeah because he created a lot of and uh perfection he and, did yeah. oh yeah we got a lot everest everest, everest. is like paper white yeah. and so it, came from it it evolves from there so yeah we just like this is what we, we, we do. have our favorites and yeah. then we sit here and have gecko conversations at yes. home <laughs> and we go back and forth about favorites and then you go from having your one favorite to naming off like 15 Ten. geckos yeah. and he's like wait what about such and such and then you're constantly reminded about the ones you left out so without further ado without us babbling on and on and on about our favorites <laughs> um let's show you this little girl Get ready for it. Hey guys, Flawless Crested Geckos here. Will, Audra, and we're here to tell you about our Patreon. Yes, going through tough times, you gotta know that Flawless is always gonna have your back. If you go over to patreon.com slash Flawless Crested Geckos, you'll see all the perks and benefits it is there for you to come and support us on our Patreon. $50 a month turns around and goes right back into your Flawless Crested Gecko savings account for you to use towards your next purchase. Any purchase. We also give awesome benefits such as 5% off off the top of the, the price of the gecko. We get free merchandise, t-shirts, we have stainless steel tables, tools, yes. <laughs> all kinds of goodies. We also give free shipping to our members all year round, no blackout dates. And, you know, we give awesome tips, or we think we do anyway. <laughs> That's right. So go over to patreon.com slash flawless crested geckos. And join our family. Yes. You want to put her up there? Okay. His contrast looks So, guys, as crazy as it sounds and looks, this is her fired up. All right. This female here is absolutely insane if she would turn right side up. <laughs> Just absolutely gorgeous. Good grief. I like, I swear, out. every time we do these Diamond Series videos, it's like I just want him to like just hold it right there so that I can just like <laughs> stare. These are just so beautiful. I mean, does it get better than that? Does it? Some may say. I'm not sure. I really don't think. It gets better than that. <laughs> so she's gotten so extreme and she's still young and she's still going to progress. Her base is dark. Mm -hmm. um, it does fade around the neck. Uh, it's all, she's almost like a two-tone base. <laughs> she <laughs> she's almost like a two-tone base. And then she's literally engulfed with white. 
Yes. I mean, she is covered up. She just um, completely covered. So, obviously, she's an extreme Harlequin. Hold on. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so, here we go. Obviously, she's an extreme Harlequin mm-hmm. with crazy, crazy spread pattern. And again, this is one of them them geckos where we we constantly tell people, don't get rid of your geckos too young yeah. if you're planning on having some holdbacks. Because I'll be honest, like when she first popped out of the she egg, she did not she, look like yeah, this. Yeah, no, it was like, okay, well, let's just put her to the side and we'll just see. But it's just like. She just blossomed. The progression on this girl was just unreal. And when you show them off, it's like, oh my god, that's gonna, that's gotta be the favorite gecko. And then you pull out another one that looks similar, yeah, <laughs> or a little bit more extreme, or a little bit more blown out. Mm-hmm. And that's like our objective. Like we want every single gecko to come out looking top tier Absolutely. or flawless. Looking flawless. That's right. So we had siblings of this gecko and gecko similar to this this pattern, mm-hmm. display of pattern. And we've held back a lot and grown out a lot, but we've released some. We have released some. Um, we've mm-hmm. released some here in the States. Um, we've released some overseas, overseas. as well. Yeah. Um, and you constantly get asked about price points on things like this, and it's very difficult. So. In this market, everything is supply and demand. When you produce geckos like this, this is a high dollar animal. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but <laughs> she's not. She's not for sale. She's not. For We've sale. moved siblings, you know. Yeah. But again, for special projects that you seek to perfect and continue to level up, oop, that you seek to. Dad, that was a good stance. She was showing herself. I know. Off. She was showing herself off. That you look to perfect and level up. You definitely need to, there she go. Well, I will tell you this, her sibling is actually one of our male breeders this year. He started, one of her siblings is um, one of our male breeders this year is holy shit. That's right. Um, And we actually got offered 10K for him and didn't take it. Right. (laughs) Again, you have to make smart decisions and for continuing this program he was not for sale not even close to for any price point (laughs) it's pretty awesome okay you guys get a good look at her she does not have a name currently so if you guys want to come up with some unique names we'll definitely take them into consideration for sure (laughs) (laughs) all right pretty Lord. Yeah, that's. <laughs> this is this is heaven sent right yeah. here. Uh, that, look, that might be a name. Heaven sent. Yeah. Well, we're going oh. probably tag her with that for now. That's a righteous uh, gecko. <laughs> yes. But um, <laughs> that looking at that geckos like that is really, really what makes you fall in love with 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 that program, that high white, that super extreme pattern. And yes, people always say, they say, well, what do you do next when you get your geckos, you know, consistently covered, you know, in pattern like that? That's what, 95%, you know, covered. I don't know. Look forward to the next project to work it into. The next project, whatever we decide with it. But it's like, at this point, we want to really push it to the limits. You know, we have the vision and we want to make sure that we execute it and stick to it. And um, if things don't work out, we move on and, and, and add a new challenge. <laughs> you know, it's happened like that before, yeah. uh, really briefly with Dalmatian lilies. Mm-hmm. You know, that really, for us, didn't really pan out to anything um, that was worth continuing to, to chase. So, but this is definitely blossoming into something that's, I mean, really, really rewarding. Just, yeah, it is. It's really rewarding. When you open up an enclosure and you see that time after time again, mm-hmm. it's just like, okay, we're doing something right. Absolutely. Again, guys, breed for yourselves first. What makes you happy yes. and chase those projects. But hopefully you enjoyed it. Hit that subscribe button. 
notification bell. Yes. Comment down below. It's yes. Will. It's Audra. Flawless Crest to Get Those. We, we out. Are out.